I just wanted to tell you guys, do not buy Alfredo sauce from the Dollar Tree. It will be your biggest mistake as far as cooking food for the day that you're cooking. I was at the Dollar Tree the other day. That's the day that I did my, my Dollar Tree shopping. You guys saw me. I, I'm in the Dollar Tree. Tell myself, I don't really feel like going next door. The grocery store is almost literally right next door to the Dollar Tree. Tell myself, oh, I just want to go home. I don't want to go to the grocery store. So I see Alfredo sauce on the shelf. And my brilliant mind, I'm like, all right, let's just go ahead and kill two birds with one, with one stone, catch two fish with one hook. I grab two of those Alfredo sauce, put in my little wagon, my cart, um, my grandma calls the carts wagon, so I somehow adapted that. But anyway, I put him in my little wagon, and as I'm checking out, I asked the girl, have you tried these, the Alfredo sauce? And she looked at me like she wanted to say that she did, but she said no, <laughs> because I wanted to ask her if the, the Alfredo sauce was good. <sighs> so I put everything in my vehicle, and then I realized I don't have the right noodles. So I still had to go next door to the grocery store to get myself some fettuccine noodles. Go in, grab myself two boxes of fettuccine noodles and come right back out and I come home. And I'm like grilling up the chicken and I'm boiling noodles because I kind of wanted it to be like Olive Garden fettuccine, chicken fettuccine Alfredo or chicken Alfredo, whatever it's called there. And chicken is grilling, noodles are boiling over here and I open up the sauce and it smells okay, it smells decent. I'm not, you know, I don't really know what it should smell like. So, pour it in, mix up my noodles, and I'm like, mmm, this looks really good. The chicken is nice and juicy. It's gonna go ahead and slice it up like how they do at Olive Garden, and it'll be the most amazing dinner we've had for a while. Ugh, it is so gross. If you are tempted to try, to, to try the, the, the Alfredo sauce at the Dollar Tree, the little jars. I wish I had kept the jar, but I tossed it. Um, don't. <laughs> Do yourself a favor and get the good stuff. Go to, you know, Safeway, go to Fry's, go to Walmart, go to, I don't know what other grocery stores. Those are the type of grocery stores, Albertsons. And um, do yourself a favor and get the good stuff, really, because it was so gross, so gross, really gross. It ruined my meal. I couldn't eat it. Sam, because he loves me, he's like, this is good, this is good. But when I asked him to be honest, he was like, it tastes, uh, and he really didn't answer. But he didn't like it. I know my husband well enough to know that he didn't like it. So lesson learned. Say no to Alfredo sauce from Dollar Tree. Good morning. It is the afternoon, though. And I am coming downstairs to make Sam and I breakfast. I think today I'm going to make um, some sausage and some hash browns. And then probably some pancakes because we have syrup and pancakes sound yummy this morning. Right now it's 12, 12.25. And yeah, we've been up for a while though, so I'm gonna start making breakfast or brunch. Brunch, start making brunch. Sam just said that my sausage made a meat flour. <laughs> and breakfast is ready. We made sausage, eggs, and hash browns, and then in the microwave over there, over there, we have some pancakes. Yummy. So this is the basket that I'm going to be working on. These are items that I want to finish up. So I'm doing the basket thing that's on YouTube. Um, first item, I have Maybelline Dream Bouncy Blush. This is the L'Oreal True Match Powder. Super blendable. A Makeup Forever um, Pressed Powder. Rimmel Fix and Perfect Pro Primer Base and Tint. This is Maybelline Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. The Sally Beauty, Beauty Supply, um, their version of the Beauty Blender. This is the Rimmel Match Perfection 2-in-1 Concealer and Highlighter. Wet and Wild, this is just a blush. An e.l.f. blush. 
Um, this is in the color Pink Passion. Next, I have another e.l.f. blush. This is in the color... What color is this? Tickled Pink. Um, a Benefit Posy Tint. A Benefit High Beam. Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I don't really care for this because I feel like it makes my lashes uncurl. This one I'm almost done with. This is the, what is this? Voluminous Butterfly Elf Eyelid Primer. Too Faced Shadow Insurance. These eyeliners that I found that I should just make my way through. Um, a Bonnie Bell Liquid Lip Smacker in the, the vanilla flavor. A Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser Dark Circles. And then the rest are just items that I use like my eyelash curler, my brush. This one I use for that Dream Bouncy Blush. Um, sharpener. Eyeliner. This one I use. I dip it in this and I use it um, to line my eyes. Clear eyes. Some tweezers. That's about it. I'm back on my old camera, my Sony Cybershot. My other camera, the battery just died out of nowhere, so. Um, we're here at Sam's Club. We need to get some dog food, because the boys are out. We usually get them to pedigree. You guys have seen me come to Sam's Club before. Uh-oh, do you see it? Nope. Ruh -ruh. Thank goodness we found it. They have six pounds of gummy bears here at Sam's Club. Ugh. And it's 8.48. I'm very tempted, but I know I shouldn't. We're purchasing dog food, candy, <laughs> candy chocolate. <laughs> I'm not gonna buy this for you now. Lindor and the free vitamin E sample. <laughs> You're such a jerk. Sam and I are in, Sam and I are here at Outback, and we decided that we're going to treat ourselves because we've been cooking at home for so long now. Um, I ordered the Outback special. Sam ordered the Outback special too with a lobster tail, and so and then we also registered for this dine rewards thing that we saw on HitToSave.com. So we're getting five dollars off our meal thanks to this. Hercules! <laughs> he stuck his tongue in my mouth! I am here with Sam. Sam, what are you thinking about right now? Right now, I am thinking that I don't want this on YouTube. But you love me. One, two, three. <laughs> Want to take one? everything you love mm. with you? Mm. Do it in style on your Pandora jar bracelet from Jared to Galleria of Jewelry. Three. Three. Has an incredible selection of the latest Pandora charms, bracelets, and jewelry. Give us a thumbs up. Telling the life story with just the turn of. We're home now. We had a pretty decent day. We went to Outback. We got some dog food at Sam's Club. Um, and now we're just home. We're watching Bringing Down the House with Steve Martin and Queen Latifah. It's pretty funny. I'm leaving Safeway now. I got my Sunday papers and I was able to score the Arizona Republic. There were two inserts in this Sunday's paper. So hopefully I score some good deals. It's the end of the day now. I'm home. I did my couponing. Tomorrow, I gotta do some cleaning. And um, we're gonna make pizza for dinner tomorrow. So tomorrow's gonna be not so much a busy day, but we already know what we're gonna be doing tomorrow. Today is Tuesday. No, today is Monday, I lied. Today's Monday and I'm gonna be doing some cleaning today. Our apartment is a mess. I would show you guys, but it's embarrassing. And then Sam will be home here soon, so we're gonna make a pizza. Well, I'm gonna make a pizza, that way when he gets back, he'll have something to eat. And then later on, I think I'm gonna go back to CVS or Walgreens because I'm on the lookout for more of those Wet n Wild Megalast. 
something lipsticks. Ah, so pretty good day so far. It's kind of cold today. I wish it would just warm up already. It's starting to really annoy me. I'm so excited. Look at the pizza I made. I made it. Uh, well, I use like a mix, but it's all good. I made the, oh, it's hot. There's a lot of cheese on that sucker and I'm very hungry. I'm just waiting for Sam to get home. And I put a bunch of pepperoni on it. So I'm very hungry. Hurry up Sam and come home so we can eat. I was just laying here just now and I thought that this water bottle with all the pretty bubbles was so neat. Why am I so fascinated by this? How come you're not fascinated by this, Sam? It's the end of the night and I am home now. I I scored my, I was looking for the Wet n Wild Mega Last whatever lipsticks and I managed to find them at CVS and at the Walgreens. So I got those and I just came downstairs to try to find something to nibble on in the kitchen because I'm kind of getting a little bit hungry again. The pizza we had was really good. It was really, really good. And Sam was very, very happy about it that he even offered to do the dishes tomorrow morning. So I'm waiting for my video to upload to YouTube. I filmed a video yesterday. Um, I was wearing this, so it's a different day, I promise. Um, I filmed a video yesterday, and I'm uploading it now. It's the 15 weird question tag, so if you're watching this vlog, go ahead and check out that video. And if you feel like you want to do those questions, let me know so that I can watch your video. And, um, hopefully it uploads okay, and that there's no issues, and that I didn't miss anything, because... <sighs> I kind of put a little bit more effort into this video than I do my other ones and it took a little bit more editing but we'll see. It's almost 5 in the evening and these two, Bandit and Hercules, I feel like they're just getting more and more difficult to walk because they pull a lot. I left on the um, Hot Passion Pink or whatever. And I feel like you can probably see my lips from space because I feel like it's really bright. But whatever. You only live once. I'm young. I can pull it off. Quickly! 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 Run! Quickly! Cross the street! Cross the street! Cross the street! Quickly! Good boys! I made these for Sam's cousin. She's actually been really, really helpful right now. Well, with Sam with um, during his his really difficult time. I made some chocolate dipped strawberries. Um, this is the chocolate melting pot that my mother-in-law and father-in-law gave me. My sisters actually gave me a second one and um, even though I don't like having doubles around, I still want to keep a second one on hand because I just like, I love making these. If you are into making chocolate covered strawberries and you haven't tried this Ghirardelli brand yet for it, it is so good. I This is my favorite one. You can get these at um, Sam's Club. Last time we checked, which was this past weekend, these were a little under $5. And even though it says dark melting wafers, it's like a double milk chocolate flavor. It's not like dark chocolate. And they come in these um, these little wafers here like this, like big giant chocolate chips. And these are actually something you can eat. So, if you haven't tried this Ghirardelli, it's my favorite for making chocolate covered strawberries.